2024 presidential race is heating up here in the United States, and it's not only the conventional red versus blue rivalry that's getting intense. The intra-party race for the Republican nomination is also getting interesting. The reason the 37-year-old entrepreneur Vivek Ramaswamy latest polls suggest that he's set to overtake Florida's Ron DeSantis as former U.S. President Donald Trump's main challenger among Republicans. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis and Vivek Ramaswamy both now have the support of 12 percent of Republican primary voters. The numbers were revealed in a Kaplan Strategies poll. Earlier, a Harvard-Harris survey put DeSantis on 12 percent and Ramaswamy on 10 percent. Harvard-Harris survey noted that DeSantis was, quote, losing steam to Ramaswamy. Like DeSantis, Ramaswamy is also a graduate of both Harvard and Yale. Some believe that the political novice difference between the two is refusing to criticize President Trump. In a political interview, Ramaswamy called himself, quote, the unapologetic nationalist in the race. Ramaswamy has made significant strides in his political journey. He outperformed six other hopefuls by more than double, marking a significant surprise in the polls. While DeSantis remains a top-tier candidate among non-Trump choices, he now shares this status with Ramaswamy. Ramaswamy has reportedly attracted 65,000 small donors. This has put him well above the threshold of 40,000 to qualify for the first Republican TV debate on August 23rd. Former Vice President Mike Pence is struggling to reach that threshold. But the bad news for DeSantis does not end in Ramaswamy. Former U.N. Ambassador Nikki Haley polled at 14 percent in a Fox Business News survey. Ron DeSantis was one percentage point behind Haley at 13 percent. As the Republican race for number two is getting cutthroat, Donald Trump is still comfortably placed at number one with a huge margin. All polls have a huge lead for Trump, ranging from 48 to 52 percent of Republican voters.